guess who's vlogging? I really have to get used to not looking at myself. So hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm really trying to get used to holding this camera. You guys forgive me if it's wobbly. This is actually my first vlog with this camera. So I'm feeling it. I feel like I look good, hopefully in the viewfinder. I have a tripod and I feel like the tripod is not sturdy. So I feel like the camera is wiggling, but you guys, just bear with me okay we gonna get it together but anyway so i'm getting ready to go to i don't know like dinner and play some games with my friends um today is thursday and yeah it's really nothing to do on a thursday here where i live so yeah but i'm about to get ready to walk out the door my friends is always talking about how late i am all the time so i was like you know what bet let me be on time this time and then y'all gonna be really talking stuff okay so um i'm getting ready to go we're supposed to meet at 7 30 and at 7 07 so i'm not gonna be late today okay i'm gonna be on time today so i guess i will talk to you guys in the car i'm still trying to get used to this this is so weird like i feel like i'm a new vlogger you guys so i'm kind of nervous i've never had a camera this is my first actual camera kind of heavy god dang how do y'all be holding these all day Hmm. I don't know how I'm gonna feel like vlogging in public because usually I just use my phone So I have to get used to having a whole freaking camera in my hand because Yeah, y'all these titties is really fucking tittying today like Lord Jesus <laughs> I have the wrong bra on for this top so we can listen to some music, you know what I'm saying get in the vibe or whatever I can show y'all what music I like and you know stuff like that so I'm about to hop on this freeway and then I'll be there shortly. Still here, I'm getting a little tipsy. I can't look at myself, I gotta look at the lens, sorry. Getting ready to take some pictures by the pool table. Tell her not to leave. I know, they don't know I'm leaving yet though. Before you allow a man to have a place in your in your emotions, in your soul, whenever you hear me talk about soul ties, this simply means that a person has a hook in your emotions and you can't seem to shake it. One of the ways a man creates a very toxic soul tie to a woman. Hey y'all, so I'm getting ready to do my self-care. Today is Sunday. Um, but yeah, I'm about to watch me some Glamour Dante. Okay, so I just got back from the gym. Well, not just got back. I took a shower and washed my hair and all that. But I'm getting ready to make me some avocado toast. I have been loving avocado toast. <clears throat> I've seen something on TikTok and I've just been kind of mimicking it. So you guys know I don't really do the whole bread thing where I can't do the bread. So I found this bread. Hold on, y'all. Let me show you. <coughs> I 
found this bread at the grocery store. It's supposed to be like keto approved. So it's been tasting pretty good. I don't feel like it's been giving me any issues. I'm on my way to get my nails done and I'm running late for three miles per usual. I'm on my way to get my nails done. It has been about a week since I popped all my nails off. I wanted to give my nails like a little break, but honestly, I miss my, like having acrylics. Like I'm just not a natural like nail girl anymore. I'm just not. If I don't have them on, then I don't feel like me. You know what I'm saying? Like I just, I don't like it, but I tried to give my nails a little break, and then too my nails are so thin like they they're stronger now since i like haven't had my nails on but when i first took my nails off they were so thin and i was just like i don't like this like i don't like the way it feels like i'm scratching myself any type of like water or something like hot water gets on it it was like hurting like it was a mess girl i'm going to a new lady um because i don't know i just want to try something new like I was going to a salon to get my nails done, but I don't know, like, what the, f I swear Nebraska with these damn potholes. Yeah, I was going to a salon, like, you know, one of those, like, Asian places, you know, but I don't know, I like when people do them, like, independently, like, I don't know, I feel like they do it better, and sometimes they're cheaper, too, I'm just gonna keep it all the way real, okay, um, they're cheaper, so, I can get like really cute designs and stuff and not have to spend like $200. Yeah, most girls around here do it in their house. Oh, okay. I like it though. I'm mad at it. If anything hurts or if you don't like something, just let me know. Okay. I don't get butt hurt. Okay. <laughs> No, I like long nails, but it's nice. Like when I'm at the salon, they're like, "Why do you want your nails so long?" It's like they question me. Like it's really? my nails. I thought they would be used to it. So no. so many girls go there for. Well, this is too long. Too long. I'm like, uh, that's how I like my nails. got done with my nails um actually had a really good appointment i really like her she talks a lot which i love because i like to talk too so i'm gonna show you guys my nails really quick these are my nails i don't know if the camera will focus i was just vlogging with my camera but my camera literally died on me midway through my sentence so I need to go ahead and buy another battery, like a couple more batteries, because I noticed that these batteries do not last, like, at all. I love the shape. I love the color. I'm going to go home and take some really pretty pictures. So, right now, I'm, like, literally starving. 
I had some content that I had to do for J Scope, so I'm literally just still sitting in my car. I hope she's not like, oh my god, this girl is still sitting out, sitting out here. But um, yeah, I had some content I had to do for J Scope, so I was like, I might as well just go ahead and sit in my car and edit really quick because it's just a row for Instagram. I'm about to go home, fix my makeup, take a couple pictures of my nails. We have like these really pretty like white trees. We have these pretty like white trees by my house. So I'm gonna go and take some pictures there because I think it'll be really pretty like of my nails. Getting ready to package up some orders. Um, I'm in my storage closet. So this is where I keep all my inventory for Poshmark. If you guys do not know, I do sell my um, clothing. Um, I have my stuff here. Everything is labeled. I love my nails, girl. Yes. Um, by number or whatever. So I just go through um, people's order and then see what they ordered. And I have everything numbered. So I think the one that I just looked up was... 289 so it should be in this box from this box. This one. so i have everything numbered that way it's easier for me to find everything or oh, maybe 284 because i remember the item so i have these little stickers So I just pulled up to my son's school. I'm just going to sit out here and wait for him and eat my Chipotle. I'm sorry. I feel like this is so loud. But you guys pretty much seen what I got on my Chipotle bowl. I don't know. I wasn't really in the mood for Chipotle, but I was just like, it's easy and quick and I'm starving. So this is better than going to like McDonald's, even though I hate McDonald's um, or like a fast food place. This is fast food, but it's healthier in my opinion. So, this is my bowl. Like I said, I'm about to sit here and eat, girl, because not one piece of, like, anything. Well, except for the grapefruit I had, the half a grapefruit. That's the only thing I ate, and you guys seen that earlier. Yeah, vlogging everything, um, it is a little overwhelming, but I love it, though. Honestly, because, I don't know, I just like vlogging. I feel like... I'm not by myself. I'm by myself a lot of the times. Like, I don't really have a whole lot of friends. So, I'm usually by myself in my own head, talking to my own self a lot of the time. Um, I don't know. So, it kind of makes me feel like I have a friend with me because I feel like I'm talking to you guys, you know? So, what y'all doing? What y'all doing? Put it in the comments right now. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Type what you doing right now. What, would, what you do today? But all right, girl. I will talk to y'all when I get home. I got some stuff from my P.O. box. I got two different packages. I'm really excited to open this. It's actually my third thing that I got my P.O. box. I'll show you guys the first thing. Well, I'll show you guys all of them when I get home. Hey, you guys. So I just made it home. And I wanted to show you guys, sorry y'all, I'm trying to get my angle right. I wanted to show you guys some of the stuff I've been picking up. Um, I've been doing a little bit of shopping, just a little bit. So I went to Sephora, Bath and Body Works. This was like a minute ago. They honestly should just let people use that gift card wherever they want to use it. Like I just do not understand why I couldn't use my freaking gift card at the regular Sephora store. Like that really irritated me. I went there, not you, I didn't go there. I was shopping online and I was adding stuff to my cart girl. Cause I'm like, I got a gift card, I'm about to shop, you know? 
no ma'am no so i got the checkout they was like oh no and then i read the little um thing on the card here and it said you can only use it um at on jcpenny.com or at a sephora inside jcpenny i was so irritated i'm like i made two different purchases one came from online and the other one is in store like i said because i couldn't use my gift card but anyway so um the first thing that i got you guys this is from tiktok i know i'm always talking about tiktok i'm literally on tiktok all the time now like i love tiktok and i cannot help it i cannot help they it. were talking about or raving about this uh glow oil they have it in like two different colors um it's cabana bronze glow oil is there a color name i think there's only two colors so you know by looking at it which one you're supposed to get sis and i'm melanin i got all this melanin so i know i needed to get this brown one right here that's the box looks like and then the actual product looks like this so this is what it looks like right here this stuff is so concentrated and so if you ever tried the boom boom is it boom boom or bum bum i think it's bum bum cream it smells just like that and i really wanted the fenty uh lava glow lava whatever it was but i just felt like it was too pricey see this is what it looks like Ooh. okay so here's what it looks like as you can see i feel like it's pretty pigmented oh it's so pretty it's like a golden color and of course i would have like smoothed it out and rubbed it out more and this is way too much so this will probably go over my whole arm and it just gives you like a nice pretty glow oh y'all okay so speaking of like the whole um i think it's oh yeah it is the same brand the soul soul sola something geneva brand so they are from the same brand this one is the boom dia bright cream and this is in the pink bottle this cream smells so good you guys i cannot like it was kind of pricey for this little ass container but um i i wanted it so i was just like i have to get it so here's what it looks like that's the name of it pick up the I'm looking for a new moisturizer and if you guys know like a good moisturizer I can try out I have sensitive skin um and I tend to break out a lot it seemed like so I picked up the milk vegan moisturizer I picked up the sample this is what it looks like picked up the sample okay so this is what it looks like excuse my ashy hands so I picked up the sample and it just looks like this but i'm telling you guys a little bit of this stuff goes a freaking long long way like i use a little bit of this like i literally just like <clears throat> i literally just like dab my finger in it and that's all i need i had got a sample of the dermalogica daily exfoliant and like something that i had brought one time and i really 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 liked it so i was like you know what i'm just gonna go ahead and buy it outright and i just picked up the little one because yeah i just i don't know stuff be so expensive and i just have a hard time spending that much money so if you guys never heard of it it's just like a powder consistency you put it in your hand you know put water in your hair and rub it on your face this right here is a great exfoliant and i have sensitive skin so and it works really good for me the dermalogica daily exfoliant so i have heard of this product so much you guys like so much and i was just like you know what I want to try it like I want to see if it works for me I really want to dibble and dab and like pills and stuff like that so I picked up the Dr. Dennis Gra Gross 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 <laughs> um, extra strength daily pills I only got this five treatment pack because of course I want to see how it works for me I'm just gonna run through this real quick <laughs> I don't know why I have this in here <laughs> somebody gave this to me and i have it in my bath and body works bag i got my sweet pea that's like a signature of mine that i get all the time i got this fiji lotion this is what it looks like waikiki beach coconut this is like one of my all-time favorites as well love this lotion this smells so freaking good salt water breeze this one smells really good too i'm a very tropical girl i love anything tropical and breezy and all that so i picked up that and also i picked up the belize tropical cabana this is what it looks like key west coconut water and melon i told you guys like i am so tropical i love tropical scents also um i wanted to show you guys kind of like what i've been getting in my p.o box as well this is her card she sent me like a lot a lot of products so i'm just going to show you guys a couple 
she sent me over this um beehive body butter oh my god it smells so good this is what it looks like she sent me over this spray this is called purple rain body mist it has a lavender coconut scent which you guys already know i love me some coconut okay so this is what it looks like it's so pretty it's purple you shake it up real good and then you go ahead and use it and it is a black owned business so that's what the spray looks like purple rain this one is from soul ties i've worked with her before um so yeah it says thank you for supporting a small business this is cute girl how you got it all wrapped up this is cute i like that so she sells um like waist beads waist ties it's kind of like what she does so yeah it comes in this little package here oh this is cute she got new stickers that is too cute and this one just says thank you it's her card this is too cute but this one here and then this pretty yellow and gold one this is cute i like this miliana v thank you. includes like a so she has like a little note at the bottom of her little package. That is too cute. I like that. That's what they look like on the package as well. I'm going to go ahead and open them. So this is the one she sent me. This is pretty. It has like a little charm on it. Like a moon, half moon, half moon charm. It's really, really pretty. I love this. I'm definitely going to be taking some Instagram pictures. So she sent me a couple different ones. Oh, this one has like little roses on it. This is pretty. I like this. I like this one too. And that is all I got for my P.O. box. Thank you to everybody that sends me stuff. Um, I really appreciate it. I'm hoping that I can give you guys what you need. Um, I'm really just, I really just like promote it like whenever I can. Like honestly, all the time. Um, especially something I can use on the daily. I'm going to be shouting you out often. So Anyways, you guys, I feel like I've been rambling enough. Um, I guess I'll talk to you guys. When I talk to y'all, I feel bad because I feel like I've been sitting here talking. But I know you guys enjoy when I'm just sitting here talking to y'all. So. Alright, so I guess I'll talk to you guys in a little bit.